because I am the teen advocate for book reading for the Monterey County Libraries. If you haven't seen my recent videos, I um, choose personal books that are available at the Monterey County Library and I reviewed them and I share my insight with you. So if you're here viewing this, hello and let's get started. The book that I will be reviewing for this video is Becoming by Michelle Obama. This is her autobiography and this is one of the um, first autobiographies that I have read. She dives into her childhood, her teenage years, her adult years, and the way she words everything and every stage of her life is truly amazing. I loved, loved, loved reading about her life and always finding little things that I can connect to and little things that I never learned before or heard before. And Michelle Obama is one of my icons. She's one of my idols. She's someone who I definitely look up to. So when I heard she has came out with this autobiography, I was like, yes, I need to get this book. I need to read it. I need to know all about, you know, my icon, my personal legend. So after her adult years, she starts talking about and diving into the relationship with Barack Obama her the way she describes the relationship with Barack Obama is such a loving thing she never sugarcoated anything dealing with the relationship because as you may may or not may not know all relationships have our times all relationships may have the best time ever there's always you know ups and downs to a relationship and the way she describes it all makes it seem so so real because you, I feel like personally, everybody stereotypes the relationship between the president and his first lady. Like they're so perfect together. They're, you know, helping America together. But in this autobiography of hers, she talks about hardships and she talks about the job complications that they had. But she also talks about the love that was there. She talks about the dates that they went into even before he ever became president, even before he was even thinking about being president. Once she gets done with her relationship, she talks about her children. She talks about her birth experience. She talks about the way she loves the way her children are as they are growing up and how they are maturing and finding their own way. She also gives her personal point of view of living in the White House and how it was being the first African-American um, first lady, which is something that I was always curious about. I was always curious, well, what is it like living in the White House? What is it like being the first African-Americans as presidency to be inside the White House? She also, within the, um, within the text, she also gives such encouraging words of wisdom. I bought the book, so I have highlighted it, but since you will be checking it out from the Monterey County Libraries, I suggest that you could get a piece of paper and you can write down, you know, the words of wisdom that she says and take that and, you know, put a pin in it in your head and be like, what did Michelle Obama say? What would Michelle Obama do? How can I connect this to my own personal life or what little things can I take from what she say and, you know, make it my own? This autobiography is truly one of the favorites that I have read, and I strongly, strongly, strongly hope that you go and you check out this book, and you love it as much as I do. There are in pic there are pictures included, which was so exciting to see from her childhood, from you know the young, lovely couple of uh, Barack and Michelle, of the presidency, and I give this book five stars 10 out of 10 and i really hope after watching this video that you consider checking out <laughs> thank you so much